Mary is apparently on Mars at the moment. Blood sugar dropped. It was like 47 and going down. So you gotta breathe. Hey guys, good morning. Mary is apparently on Mars at the moment. We uh, were sitting in the back of her parents' car. Uh, we came to do some after Christmas shopping and uh, Mary's blood sugar dropped. It was like 47 and going down a few minutes ago and she's like out of it. But that so. was like after I fixed it. Yeah, she had already had apple juice and candy and trying to get that blood sugar up. So we're sitting in the car until Mary's feeling a little more stable to walk into the store. And, wowzy. I don't know why I feel the need to do the peace sign over and over. <laughs> Apparently, um, <laughs> I think she's in a peaceful daze, I guess. No. No. But happy day after Christmas, guys. We're hanging out with Mary's family for the first half of the day, and then second half of the day, we're having a family gathering with kind of all my, I want to say extended family, but it's kind of immediate family, all my siblings and kids. And, not all of them, though. Yeah, not all of them, um, which is sad, but it's hard to get everyone together for Christmas. And um, so we're going to get this blood sugar up, and we will see you guys later. Okay, we, I'm all better, and we're in Walmart, and they have all their Christmas clearance, and I'm so excited, and Peter reminded me. It was about last year. Yeah. Last year, Mary was, I remember coming on December 26th to Walmart, but in Massachusetts, and Mary was too sick to go out, so I came out to shop for wrapping paper for her. And he showed me, like, the ones they had and stuff, so. Picking wrapping paper. Also, you guys know we needed a stocking for Harry Boy. And of course, they didn't have an H, but they also didn't have Oliver's O. So we have S for Harry and B for Bonesy, and they are affectionately known as Skin and Bones. So we, I cannot believe they had that, of the four that they had. Um, and getting some wrapping paper. My parents are here somewhere. I just had to come in later because of my blood sugar. So we'll find them. Oh! They do have them, babe, right there. White lights. Wow. Hi, guys. Um, we're exhausted. We had a good last few days here with our families. Heading back to North Carolina, my brain almost said Massachusetts. Heading back to North Carolina tomorrow morning. And we're thankful that we had these days with our families. Like we mentioned earlier, last year, I my body just wasn't able to make the trip back. And so we've learned over the years that sometimes we have to be creative with when and how we celebrate holidays. And you guys know that we celebrate birthday week because sometimes birthday day, birthday your, month. Your, your body isn't up for celebrating. So. This year, we were th very thankful that my body was up for celebrating on the actual day, which was Christmas, and the day after, or whenever our events were. So, we're very thankful we were able to come, and now we are so exhausted. Hey, guys. <sighs> wow, see. Um, it, yeah, it's so good, so exhausting, so many things. We just... So, immersed ourselves into spending time with family today, so that's why we've been, there's a big gap between the last clip and this one, but, um... I randomly had a dream last night that I wanted to tell you guys about, or tell my future self about, in case I forget about it. I had a dream that I was at the doctor's, and I had to bring all my Trikafta cards, they come on those cardboard packs, bring them back with me so they could give me the next set or something like that. And they were like, okay, well, we'll count how many pills you've missed. And I was like, I haven't missed any. I haven't missed any pills. It's almost been five months. Which, crazy guys, right? That I've almost been on it for five months. 
Crazy. January 2nd will be five months. And I was like, I haven't missed any pills. And the doctor was like, oh, okay. Walked out of the room and I looked down and in one of the boxes, there was a loose morning pill, like one of the morning doses. And I was like, oh no, I did miss a pill. And I just was like really concerned in my dream. But you actually haven't. Oh, in real life, I haven't missed any. I know it's gonna happen and I thought it happened. But that is a nice thing about them coming on those cards is that you can always like tell if you've taken it or not. But yeah. anyway, that was my random dream from last night. I wonder what we'll dream tonight. I don't know, but Mary's dreaming about being with Harry tomorrow. Yeah, I'm excited. Are you excited? I am, yeah. yeah. I think because it's new that Harry's part of our family, it's, it was especially hard to kind of leave him at home. Yeah. Um, but it's what was best for him. And yeah. So we're excited to get back to him. And I think it contributed to us kind of making the trip shorter, but we also like have a lot of life stuff coming up and it, I think we're both kind of exhausted. And so it's good that we go back and yeah. regroup for well, a, few, a few days. Monday, Monday morning, I have altitude testing, which is to see if my lungs can handle, like are strong enough to oxygenate in the higher altitude of flying. flying. Thank you. Yeah. And then... Because we have a trip coming up in February where we'll, we'll be flying and so... Right. And then Monday afternoon, Oliver gets his stitches out. Whoop, whoop. Which that's been healing it's as great. far as we know really well. Like he's been... Yeah. Seems uh, not bothered by it at all. And so that's been good. Yeah. I sent a picture to the vet maybe two weeks ago, a week and a half ago, something like that. She said, it looks great, just keep yeah. doing what you're doing, which is just, you know, leash walking him and not not letting him run as much as he wants to. It's kind of hard to keep him from running, but anyway, all is well, guys, and as always, we'll, we'll see, see you tomorrow. tomorrow. Good, Good night. night. Good night.